What's up, everybody? This is your boy, Antoine Criminal Mosley. Welcome to another episode of Ask Criminal 2K12. I got 10 more questions right here on my pad, and I'm ready to answer them for you guys right here, right now. So did your question make this episode? Let's not waste any more time. Let's find out, shall we? Who wouldn't want to be a fan of video game music? I've been a fan of video game music since, what, Mario and Sonic days? But the thing about video game music is sometimes they have soundtracks that are pretty interesting. You know, you'd be surprised what kind of soundtracks they use in video games. And another reason why I like, I'm a fan of it is because it's easy to use in like various situations, like especially if you want to make a video. And you have songs that you want to use, but then they get blocked because, okay, you can't use this, so we're going to have to take your video down. Stick with video game music because it's the easiest thing and everybody uses it. Okay, And one more reason why I like video game music. Remixes are top-notch these days. So a lot of people are going to stick to using video game music as a means of making a remix for anything they want because it works that and it's easy to freestyle to I've done it before and I will do it again this is easy no <laughs> there has not been one episode where I did where I didn't have to go back and say all right let me do this again because I didn't like it or let me work on this one again or let me take it let me take another shot at it because I didn't like the way that this sounded, I don't like the way that sounded. No, there's always going to be an episode where I'm going to mess up, I'm going to say things that don't make sense, that I have to reword them. So it, it takes a while. You know, it definitely takes a while, but I have yet to perfect one episode. And quite frankly, knowing me, I don't think that's going to happen anytime soon. I'm going to tell you that right now. It's very difficult to put a show together. Ask anybody out there in the film industry, in, the, in TV land, just ask them. It's not that easy to do, okay? So until the day comes where I perfect one of my episodes, expect to see a lot of outtakes, I'm telling you right now. They're funny, but just expect to see a lot of them. It's a pretty interesting question. I run with Boost Mobile right now, so hey, I'm paying thirty-five dollars a month for my for my plan, no contract whatsoever. So I kind of like it. I had T-Mobile before, but they screwed me over, so I really wouldn't prefer them right now. Verizon, they say they do a lot, but unless I know somebody that actually has a Verizon plan, I can't really put two and two together on that one. And as far as Sprint goes, I like Sprint. Sprint's a good comp Sprint's a good uh, phone company. So if I had to prefer any of these, I would say Sprint. Go with Sprint. Duh! <laughs> you can't miss this one. Halloween Horror Nights this year is going to be great. the The theme, the main theme for this year is The Walking Dead. So if anybody is a fan of The Walking Dead that shows up on the TV, you know, the season, the series, everything like that. If you're a fan of The Walking Dead, go to Halloween Horror Nights. They're going to be all over the place. That and Silent Hill has its own haunted house. Silent Hill, the franchise, the game, the storyline, everything. And the reason why they brought Silent Hill is because they're promoting the new one that's coming out this Halloween. So be ready for that. Also, Alice Cooper has his own house. You have the original Scare Zones. Of course, you have uh, Penn and Teller's show, Bill and Ted's show. Just a lot of creepy things going on. And believe me, the zombies running around with chainsaws, scaring everybody. It's hilarious. So I'm definitely going to Halloween Horror Nights this year. I'm definitely fighting him, okay? There's not one moment where I'm going to sit there and say, yeah, I'm going to just start talking like Mike Tyson every day. See where that gets me. That's not going to get me anywhere. Okay, I'm telling you right now, it's not going to get me anywhere. So if I had a chance, if I had a choice, I would fight Mike Tyson. 
I'll take a dive, maybe win about, get about two, three million dollar purse, but I would take a dive instead of talking like Mike Tyson all day. Because it's, it's, it's ludicrous. You can't sit here and talk like this all day. It, it, it doesn't make any sense. So if you want to sit there and talk like Mike Tyson all the day, that's fine. I mean, if you want to act like the scene from The Hangover and start singing that uh, Phil Collins song all day, then hey, you can do what you want. But I'm not going to sit here and talk like Mike Tyson. I'm sorry. Sound like you have lists anyway. Mike, don't come after me for that one, please. <laughs>
Hey, how you doing? Thought about you. Hope everything's well. You don't take two seconds out of your day to do that. You don't deserve to have anybody in your life. You don't deserve to have any friends. Straight up. You know, I always drop a line every now and then when I have time. You know, I'm a busy person. I'm a busy man. But that's just the way it is. You know, I got, I have a job. I work. You know, I do my filming and everything like that. I, I'm busy. But at the same time, I take about two, three seconds out of my day just to drop a line to people and say, hey, you know what? Thought about you. Hope everything's all right. You know, I mean, I get a reply back, but at least I did that for me. You know, out of my heart, I did that for, for people out there, for my friends that I'm close to. So just say it, man. If you got people out there that you really want to stay close in your life, drop them a line every now and then. Say hi. You know, don't even... You don't even gotta like make it like a four page letter. Just drop in and say, hey, you know, thought about you, thought I'd say hi. Just gotta get back to work. Watch how watch how happy they feel about that. Makes their day a lot better. And it makes your day better too. Wouldn't you think? The consideration is definitely there. And the way things are going pretty good possibility and I could be leaving Orlando in the near future um, it's not gonna be right away but things are happening things are definitely happening and if it's my time to go I gotta go but trust me Orlando has been my home for 12 years and I couldn't see it any other way if anything, if I had to leave, I'd probably go back home to Atlanta. Okay? That's my that's the only other place I would know for sure that I could be like I could feel home. Or feel at home because I would be home. You know. Orlando's my home away from home. Atlanta's my home bar none. Okay? Straight up. So if I was ever to consider leaving Orlando, Atlanta would be the only place I would go. Simple as that. <laughs> All right, guys, that'll do it for another episode of Ask Criminal 2K12. That's the way it goes. You guys give me the questions, I give you the answers right here on this show. If you'd like to see your question answered on the next episode, hit me up on the link, and I'll be sure to check your questions out. If I like what I see, your questions could very well be answered right here, just like these were. But until then, I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. Thank you guys so much for delivering all the questions. Keep them coming because I guarantee you there's gonna be one episode very soon that's gonna be a big, big, big Ask Criminal episode, all right? I'm gonna answer more questions on that show than I've ever done before, and it will be live, it will be uncut, it will be uncensored, so be ready for that. But until then, I'm gonna go ahead and jet. My name is Antoine Criminal Mosley, naturally. Thank you for watching, and I'll holler at you guys later. Peace out.